everybody, sorry about the delay in the video. Uh, haven't been doing much in here. I've been working on outside uh, irrigation and stuff like that. So, But I can give you what I changed. Uh, here's the aquaculture system. I am going to turn this into a mini aquaponics system. So and I'll show you what I changed. Uh, not quite done, but pretty much done. So before you remember, I had this solids removal going into a biofilter into the sump. Well, I changed that. I got rid of the biofilter and I dug a deeper hole here just for the sump. So I'm going right from the solids removal to the sump. Uh, the reason I'm doing that is I'm actually going to be turning this into a little aquaponics system here. Uh, here's my towers. I'm sorry, uh, the NFT, you know, the water will, the pipe that's up here will come down, go into that one, down that way, down that way, and split two to the bottom and then down. If you look here, try to get this where you can see, I staggered the plants, you know, like where they go back. If the back plants do okay with light, I'm going to do the add three more here. But I also have the hanging towers here. Okay? And the water for these will come in here, trickle down, go all the way through with the plants, growing out this way. And I will have a gutter system. These will all drain into a gutter until it gets to this side right here. The gutter will go onto the end of the four inch which these will drain into and that will go down to the sump. Uh, that's another reason I lowered the sump to make the gravity feed a little better just just to make it easier and everything like that. Uh, so that is the actual aquaculture system right here. It's now kind of turning into aquaponics and I, I don't know if I can get a couple towers here. I might. Uh, it gets a lot of shade. I might put uh, some really, really shade loving crops right there. And I can have these towers a little tighter than normal because light doesn't have to get through them. Uh, if everything works fine with these, I really believe I got four in between each of these here. I think I can get five in between there. And how I'm holding them up is I had some half inch PVC. So I just cut a length of PVC, put it down, you can kind of see it on the top right there, put it across and screwed it down so it doesn't move. So that I can just unscrew that, move it over and screw it back down. So that'll be real easy. And there was a little angle, so you can see the two by four there. Uh, that's just so that PVC isn't down like this and these towers don't slide over time. I didn't think that would happen, but uh, it's better to be safe than sorry. So I really think I can get five between these instead of four, but uh, we will see. And with all of this is uh, acting as my biofilter for the aquaculture system, that's why this will be in aquaponics. And these here will be grown strawberries, lettuce, whatever we want. We, we don't quite know here, but uh, that's just to uh, try something else and get everything else. So that's it there. And one thing I did change, uh, I was having a problem with fish, small fish going in, up the stand pipe and over and down and they would end up in the sump. So what I did is very simple. This is the three inch, you know, net cup I have in there. Uh, if this was the bottom of the stand pipe, you know, I just put it in and it's sitting in the bottom just like this. So all I have to do is once they're bigger and the solids get bigger, I can just take that out and then go back down. So that little net cup worked perfect. So I don't have any issues with that anymore. And it's easy to remove. Uh, it's working so well, my big fish tanks, which you can see here, and that's the bottom, I'm actually gonna look for because uh, I will have a three inch pipe at the bottom. I want to look for uh, a big four or five inch net cup. So uh, the, one of the reasons I'm doing this now is there's a little delay in the big system here because we were going to put the fish tanks here. We are not. 
we're actually going to be putting them out there and I'm going to wall that off. It already has a roof. I'm going to wall that off and the fish tanks will go out there just to add more grow room in here. So that will leave, let me go here, you can kind of see a little better. Back up here. I can have a big area over here for seedlings. And if I need to right here, I can get some hanging towers or do something like that over here or a big NFT tray or something to that extent right there. So that's it. I hope everybody has a great day. Um, any questions, please let me know. Uh, and sorry about the long delay in this video. Have a great day.